Welcome back to my channel. I've got another unboxing for you again today, so we'll just crack on. I'm going to try and do as much as I can minimally with the bags because they are noisy. So I've got two cross stitches. Um, I have no idea which is which. How will I do? Right, I'm just going to run this over there. I'm going to take it out of the bag and then pull it back. Move the chair before I pull it over it. Let me just put those there. Right, threads are at the bag too, so I'll put them there. Okay, so first things first, as always, we have the needle bag, the pom pom with five needles, the needle threader, and the thimble with a lovely little cheetah panther. Not sure. Anyway, we have the instructions, which usually come on here but I assume because it's smaller I'll have to show you the image on here because it's not I haven't got a, another one so your instructions just in case you need to cross stitch how to do all your stitches I don't think there are ever any half stitches on these things so I'll show you this if it doesn't show up too well I will get it off their website yeah that's not brilliant is it okay this is the image let me focus you, that might help. It's a stained glass owl. Rainbow coloured as usual. I like rainbow. So that is the, we should have that door because it just keeps banging. There we go. Unprofessional today, I tell you. Yeah, so this is the chart. Oh, it's very staticky on the back. As usual, it's the shiny back plastic, so they tend to last quite well. Um, just in case I didn't say, this is from New Crafty. Mm. The chart doesn't seem too bad. It's a tiny little bit fuzzy, but I can still see what everything is. So that's okay. You've got your legend down the side as usual. And this says you've got 40 colours. It's 190 by 190 and it is an 11 count. Yeah, 11 count kit. 50 by 50. Okay, so let's look at the fabric. Alley up. There we go. Now usually the 50 by 50 refers to the whole piece of fabric. Um, not... The stitched area itself. Um, it's a lot of number three, which is three turn. Yeah, so you also have your legend on the side of your fabric too if you don't have your uh, chart out. Let's check out the stamp. Let's focus. Okay, that's not looking too bad, is it? Let's just move up. Yeah, that's not looking too bad. That's uh, pretty clear. Okay, the edges are surged, which is always a bonus. So that's the fabric. So, because there's a lot of 310, obviously, we have three hanks of 310. I think I've got a thing for 310. I seem to buy a lot of kits with uh, a lot of black in. Oh my goodness, these are really rainbow colours. Let me just try and get these unfolded. It's never the best. Uh, that one as well. Right, okay, so... Oh, hey, give me a second. 37 to 41. 
absolutely gorgeous colours on this one. Love this one. It's like a spearmint blue but a bit darker. So yeah, they come on this card. I've never had an issue with these cards. I don't take any of them off. And they last me pretty well. So, let's move on to numbers 1 to 18. So we'll kind of go backwards, 18 is this end. So look at those for vibrant rainbow colours. Absolutely gorgeous. And then numbers 19 to 36. Very dark teal. Oh, some more of the spearminty blues. And the dark blues. Awesome, awesome colours. Just look at those. <laughs> right now, let me tell you a little bit about them. I'm not going to put them away on camera. I will do it after. But let me just fill you in a little bit first. The owl kit is £9.46. Oh, now this is the one I couldn't find how to switch. Mm. There it is, it's right in front of my face. And it's $12.08 if it's in dollars. I'll do Canadian dollars as well. $16.33. Gorgeous kit. Whoops, I need to drop my tablet. Right, let me just put these to one side. Over there. Let me just take this one away, open it, and then I'll bring it back. So this one, that's not a very good image on the um, on the chart. See, it makes my camera look like it's not focusing, but it is. You can tell by the writing up here. That just look, looks a bit fuzzy. But this is the chart anyway. It's 104 by 148, and it is the Minions. I love the Minions. Mm. It seems to be quite a common thing at the moment you can sort of see the inks a tiny bit smudged so they possibly folded this when it was still damp the ink your instructions are on here mm, it's another 11 count kit with 26 colors yeah I mean even down here it's a little bit fuzzy I will let them know about that I mean, it shouldn't be an issue because I think I can still see. Yeah. I think it's okay. I can work with it anyway. I forgot to show you. You get your usual kit. Five needles in a pom-pom. Thimble and threader. So this is a fairly small kit. Oh, wow. I can see the minions already. So 104 by 148, like I said. Your legends down the side as well. The edges are surged again, which is fantastic. That's a lot of confetti. I think you guys can see just how confetti it is. There are little blocks of colour. But other than that, it seems um, a bit confetti. Why is it that? Thank you. It seemed to unfocus itself. So the stamping looks good. It does look good. Now we'll deal with the colours. Let me just unwind. Oops. Having a fight with them. Okay, so we've got numbers 1 to 18. 
so we've got a bit of dark green let me move this so you can see better very dark green wow mm, liking that color bit of red I was expecting a bit more yellow actually because of the minions I'm going to assume then that we've got a bit of this in there as well and we have got a we've got a little chunky yellow here number 24 which kind of matches because we've got 24 all the yellow on there is this one oops so yeah we've got a bit and bear in mind the kit's not as big so a bit of um pinks too yep they're all on the card as usual so easy to work straight from the kit so that's kit number two and i don't know if there's an image on this well there is but it's only a tiny one kit number one so let me tell you about kit number two this is what it should have looked like. <laughs> it looks better on there, right? Canadian dollars is eight forty six, US dollars six twenty six, and then if you live in the UK like I do, it's four pound ninety, which is not bad. It's not a tiny kit, but it's not a big one either. So this is, like I said, new craft day. They have their um, spend 31 32 to get one free gift buy one item save seven percent and obviously you guys know I have discount codes so um, let me just double check on my my emails actually I think yeah there is a discount code ten percent so I will put that in the description box as well just for you guys um, Thank you to New Craft Day for sending me these kits for review. I am so looking forward to both of them. The owl is just, I have a thing for stained glass at the minute. They seem to be making some really gorgeous ones. And minions, well, they've just been a long standing thing in our race as long as Toy Story. So, um, thank you to you guys too for popping in and checking out these two kits with me. Um, if uh, there's some information I have missed that you'd like to know, Feel free to shoot me a comment and I will get back to you. If I don't know, I'll ask them and then I will get back to you. But uh, not a problem. So enjoy the rest of your week, guys. Take care, stay safe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.